What is a health, safety, security, and environment management system, and what does it do? At its core, it's about making sure bad things aren't going to happen to anyone or anything as a result of your business. For a management system to work, we need to know what we're managing. This means identifying the key risks from our operations to the different groups that could be impacted. Our business itself, employees, contractors, stakeholders, and the environment. And reviewing those risks in a structured, meticulous manner to test and refresh our systems. An HSSE management system exists to provide a structured approach to control risk and to be able to demonstrate that control. It must be written down, communicated, and practical. Let's look at the four key elements in an HSSE management system, starting with the HSSE plan and inspection checklists. This is a strategic action plan that sets out all of the current and prospective risks for a company with a plan to remove or reduce the risk with a timeline and a budget. For workers, this is a portion of their work. It is inspections to check that things are working as they should and emergency response plans for when they don't. The first part of our HSSE management system is really about known risks and how we manage them. The second element looks at how we document all risks in a workplace, including potential ones. We need to continually monitor risks and the higher the risk, the higher the frequency of monitoring. HSSE management systems aren't a one and done thing. This is a living, breathing, evolving understanding of risk and how we keep our workplace safe. This part of our HSSE MS is saying, what else do we need to consider? The third element is reporting. This is a way to check if we're getting the right outcomes. TRCF, SIF, days since last incident, Those are all metrics that can help identify areas for improvement and spot trends over time. Care is needed though, as over-focusing on certain aspects can lead to unintended behaviors. The third element is how are we doing? The final part of an HSSE MS is around training and inductions. This ensures workers know rules, risks, and safety procedures. It can include safety training, drills, accident simulations, hazardous waste management practice, and more. It's important to document training and solicit feedback to ensure it's working for workers. The final element of an HSSE MS is looking at how do people know what they need to do to be safe. An HSE management system isn't a binder that sits on the shelf. Instead, it's a capture of people thinking critically about what can cause harm and agreeing together on the actions they need to take to stop it. It's striving to uncover new risks and to test if the barriers we're relying on are working as they are intending. And it's equipping all of our people at all levels of the organization with the tools to do work safely.